Yes, sir, baby. Hope we are doing well, man. What a beautiful Saturday, April 22nd, 2023. Well, welcome back to another upload. It's a beautiful Saturday, man. Ultimate Legends are here. All four Ultimate Legends are 99 overalls. We have the two LTDs, Larry Allen and Michael Strahan, as you can see on your screen. We also got Joe Montana and Charles Woodson. An absolute big, big Quack. drop right on our forehead. Jesus Christ. We got three million training, man. Your boy needs both of these guys on their team. I need Joe Montana on my team. I need Charles Woodson on my team, man. We're going out there. We're trying to pull whatever we can. If you like the video, make sure you like the video. Comment down below as well who you're copping out of this new drop don't forget to sub man it's free for you doesn't cost you a thing there's a love goal is 20,000 subs by the end of the year so if i hit that sub button already i definitely appreciate it all right let's take a peek man uh market should be coming down again because of the overall boost right 97 96 i'll be live on stream later tonight i'm gonna save all my ultimate legends for stream tonight so make sure you are there man uh, we're gonna have a bunch of ultimate legend packs that we're gonna open on there i'm gonna be ripping a lot of packs man because i want to get joe montana i mean all these cards are must cops for your team man joe montana the best quarterback in the game probably right now 84 speed 98 throw power 98 short 98 medium 97 deep 98 throw under pressure 97 throw on the run and 99 play action end game quarterback for sure if you want to use him if 49ers get legends theme team he's probably going to be on most Mostly everybody's team if you get your free ultimate legend token today which you should he is definitely a player you want to use it on uh because he'll be your end game quarterback uh charles woodson all right 1.3 million coins man these guys are expensive they should be coming down in price i'll be coming dropping below a mil for sure market's starting to crash as well man 99 speed 98 excel 96 agility 99 jump 96 play rec 98 man 99 zone 98 press i mean this card's insane too raiders theme charles woodson is one of my all-time favorite players man that guy was so good even on the pay i think he won a ring on the packers uh that's where he won the ring on straight hand here we go 94 speed 97 excel 98 strength 94 tackle 98 play rack 99 block 99 power 98 finesse move power rusher archetypes will 65 one of the two ltds um uh, i know tcps are back would i recommend open tcps over tvps probably not i'm gonna be ripping tvps for the next couple days because i want both larry allen and michael strayon on my team because both of these cards are pretty much end game now both are going for a million coins too so if you can pull them great we all know that ultimate legend ones are super hard to pull man larry allen's two million coins what there's only a few of them he is an end game guard as well 99 strength 97 awareness with 99 pass block i mean 99s across the board and 99 run block 63 ultimate legend chem he's gonna get too i did want to give an up update for o-line as well if you do get john madden which he is in packs again on the tcps 99 john madden left tackle actually gets right tackle now as a secondary position so i mean there's something you got to pick up too but let's warm them up baby we'll do uh like one or two pro elites what i've noticed i did a bunch of pro elites offline i'm gonna have i think i'm gonna have a tiktok sh uh, probably a tiktok short or a youtube short maybe both a couple lts we pulled last night doing a um pro elites and tvps on stream uh but what i've noticed about these things is i've been feeling like pro elites have been paying really close to almost one per definitely like one one to one two like some of the cheapest training that i've been getting um i've been getting some cheap training from sniping especially today i've been looking under 97 ultimate legends i'm getting it for like one two almost one one which is good because tvps pay out at about one one so that's pretty much your breaking even through the whole pack opening so this is what's good yes they do are more expensive but if you get your training for a little bit cheaper and they pay out the exact same that you got i mean then it's free training but i just see here 48 thousand which is roughly about one three so that's almost the same as buying your training so i'm gonna be ripping a bunch of ooh 94 toronto offset all right i'm gonna be ripping a bunch of uh, packs online tonight man because i really want to get both these ltd i'm gonna be going crazy next two days 89 cool we're warmed up let's go ahead and rip what do i want to do though do i want to do tcps did they change anything with these one random item from the following 98 and 96 ring of honor players okay so they added 98 and 96 ring of honor players wonderful so if you see the animation you can get fucking cold now 97 ultimate legend boss players 94 plus redux is 95 team infinity players 80 plus platinum players with a chance of a 99 overall randy moss d on sanders bears okay so everything's the same they took out combine players and swapped it out with 98 ring of honor players i since the ltds are so expensive i truly don't think tcps are going to be worth it this time but if you want to get some of the 99s like if you want to buy out your team back if you did wait on your team today is a good time to do it Deion sanders randy moss those high value players if you could pull ltds and tcps then yes i would 100 percent rip those but since the ltds are so expensive man i'm ripping all these so we got about three million trains so it's about 100 packs we're gonna rip this whole thing we're gonna have a redux centers episode so dropping tomorrow it's going to be a banger too we got a decent amount of uh, 97s are going to be marking off the list so i'm excited for that let me know uh, in the comments below if you want to see tcps for redux hunters or tvps i really hope you say tvps because fuck tcps i don't really like them that much as we're gonna get a redux come on now okay camera wake i thought it was in tcps for a second a lot of people did like tcps i mean they might be boosted right we got boosted odds so we don't know how tcps are they could be really really good again i'll be live on stream later tonight so i will go ahead and test all those i'll be doing one million training 
I'll be doing a bunch of Ultimate Legend packs. I may start building the team tonight because I definitely want to because the market's starting to come down more and more. I think there's some high value players that I want to go ahead and, uh, and try to snag right now, especially like John Madden. I want Larry Allen, but I'm really going to try to pull him. He's, he's one I'm going to have to chase after. I mean, I haven't seen the Ultimate Legend animation on this account in I don't know how long. So I'm hoping today is the days we're going to get a Tim Infinity card. But today, for some reason, too, what I've noticed is the servers seem to be running pretty smoothly. Knock on freaking wood right now. But when I was typing trading, it was running smooth. Even when I got to the part where some cars had that moving animation that kind of made it lag it wasn't happening it felt like the servers were actually pretty decent then again i don't know how much worse uh they can actually get is we're gonna get 95 patty m okay i just want to say this for the record and i don't know if this is like true or not but when tvps first came out on thursday when they updated them they were fucking trash yesterday and even today they feel a little bit better i'm not saying they boosted the odds i'm not saying that they adjusted them i'm just saying the last couple days definitely feel like they were cranked a little bit which is what we want i mean we know ultimate legend uh ltds are fucking impossible to pull out of these things but that's okay man because i'm here i'm gonna pull the ultimate legend animation and it's gonna be larry allen that's the one i want the most obviously because he's two and a half million like coins. if i pulled him right now would i keep him i don't know i might if he's over two mil i might sell him i mean it's really really hard to keep a card over two million coins so i honestly might i honestly might sell him if he's like two to two one and then i'll try to buy him back at like tomorrow for like one and a half because it's so hard to keep a two million coin card bro I started getting mopped because I said something about these things being good. Now it's a bunch of 80 and 81. So here we go, hot hands. Well, let me know today if you guys are going to open TCPs more than TVPs. I feel like TCPs are, I don't know how to, I don't know how I feel about them. I can't really tell. Do I think they're cool? I guess so. I feel like TCPs are going to take over TVPs, honestly. 85 Trey Smith. I don't know if they're going to add golden tickets into only TCPs if we're going to have like two different options, right? There's a reason why they're throwing TCPs in here. I don't know what the reason is, but now if there's going to be start being like a weekly thing for TCPs, are we going to get golden tickets in TVPs or are they going to just put them in tcps only i feel like what they're gonna do is drop golden tickets and then drop tcps and put them in there for a couple days so make it like a limited time thing as we're gonna get 88 derrick henry we'll take that and then remove tcps for a couple days drop them next week drop the next packs of golden tickets that's what i feel like they're doing they honestly drop golden tickets and it's only in tvps they keep dropping tcps i mean there's really no point to open tcps at all right i don't know what they're gonna do with it yet I, I don't know i don't really care for tcps that much it's good if you're trying to buy your team back as we're gonna get 87 nick bosa they're starting to turn up if you're not then someone comment below why tcps are so important or so crazy for you guys because some people love that pack more than anything and i don't understand why i mean 94 plus redux is, is i should be excited for right for redux hunters but i mean i think i pull a million training if not 20 million training out of those things i pulled 297 so it's very rare for that to happen we're gonna get uh, paved the way legendary god I'm, dude these feel a little bit better and now that i pulled a legendary strat that's one thing i noticed out of tcps i don't think i've ever pulled a legendary strat out of those things out of all the time i've ripped like 15 20 million training however much i ever did I never pulled a legendary one other it's so weird i pulled like a couple 99 sure but pull rates just seem atrocious tvps now i'm telling you last couple days they feel a little bit better legendary strat we'll take it baby we're about halfway in so far we're doing all right um i think we're probably broken even maybe we're down a little bit no big pulls we started off with a couple reduxes that were pretty solid but other than that it hasn't been too great man redux is kind Kind of just died out a little bit but we're getting decent coin quick sells and good purples right now damn dude these are actually starting to fly out with purples and legendaries again oh cardinals too interesting we'll take that all right man we're back in bangers we got about 800k left it's been pretty dry honestly the last like 500k has been just a bunch of like silvers 80 81s 82s i did a little reset too to kind of help it out so we can clutch up at the end of it but i did get a decent amount of like legendaries and purples again and then like a decent amount of 85 plus coin quick sells only two reduxes and those were like right off the bat right we pulled the cameron wake and then a few packs later we pulled patty m and that was it we haven't pulled anything since Oh, come on, baby. Come on. Larry Allen. Let's fucking go, baby. Come on now. That's what I'm talking about. So I'm talking about baby 99 Larry Allen. Let's go, dude. Oh, now I don't have to buy him. Oh, I'm debating if I want to sell him, though. He's like 2.2 million coins. That's fucking wild, bro. Holy frick. 99 Larry Allen. I'm so glad. That was the first time since all the, the big Ultimate Legends have come out that we finally get to pull one of the more expensive 99s. I don't know what to do with them. If I should sell him or if I should keep him. Oh, my God. God, these just turn like crazy. 97 Justin Jefferson. Holy frick. 97 Justin Jefferson, too. We'll take that. He is a new Redux. So I'll mark him off the list. You guys are seeing this right now. I'm not going to cut it out for Redux hunters. We'll put that on the uh, uh, tomorrow's episode. So, I mean, the last like little bit we're in backhand bangers just went crazy we pull larry allen and like three packs later we pull 97 justin jefferson so good right now man as we get another redux that'd be crazy if it was another 97 i mean we pull larry allen i don't know if i'm gonna keep him if i'm gonna sell him i feel like i have to sell him right now man if he's 2.2 million coins and i feel like i have to buy him back i should buy him back but i don't know if he's gonna drop anymore i would assume he will i think he'll get to like 1.6 1.5 you take your coins from him and then you buy him back cheaper you make a little bit of profit that way but i might just hang on to him man because he's gonna be my end right guard for the whole year these packs actually went crazy we had started off really good it died out and then it just took off at the end Pro 
prime example of back end bangers. Absolutely love to see it. 84 Denzel Perryman, man. Uh, we're almost done. We got to do it like 10 more times. I'm happy. I'm probably going to go buy Michael Strand. I think Michael Strand is definitely going to drop to like hopefully 700K. Dude, these started turning up out of nowhere at the end of it. I'm telling you, man, I feel like they really cranked them a little bit. TVPs have been a little bit better. Um, but I'm going to pick up Michael Strahan for sure. I'm going to do the whole team rebuild. I think we're going to do that on Sunday stream. Um, If you didn't see, I'm going to have a, a post on it on Twitter and on YouTube. My stream schedule is going to change. I'm not going to be doing every day anymore. I'm going to do like three, maybe four times a week because we're going to get 92 Geno Smith. Monday wednesday and friday i'm not streaming because now that i'm a little bit more healthy i can go back to the gym which i really want to focus on getting healthier that way i'm going to use the monday wednesday and fridays as my main gym days where i can focus not have to rush to like do a quick workout after work um just so i can come stream so i'm going to take those days off especially in the back end of madden and we're going to have a lot more well edited videos coming your way too it's actually going to be fucking insane how many what we have in store for you guys especially for the back end of madden we're still going to do daily content as much as i can if i'm working on a video it takes me a little bit longer then i might skip a day but it's going to be worth it because they're <laughs> insane team builder videos that i have ideas for it's going to definitely be a great back end of the year just because madden's dead doesn't mean i'm not going to do my best to entertain you guys if i miss streams a little bit more it's going to be well worth it trust me two more man and we're all done we made profit we pulled larry allen we pulled a 97 justin jefferson as well pulled a bunch of heat and i'll be live on stream later tonight might be streaming a little bit earlier too because if i'm gonna be pulling uh tbps all day i want to be live as much as i can ending it with an 87 man these things are great if you like the video make sure you like the video do not forget to step on the way out man stay with something guys tell your mom and tell your daddy catch you guys on the next video